All right, here's something from Jared Connor, mm -hmm. also writing to us on Facebook. Dr. Tyson, can solar systems form in the intergalactic medium? If so, could there be planets in those solar systems with intelligent life? Ooh. So this person has vocabulary. Yes. Intergalactic medium. medium. All right, so what we have is between the planets, we call that interplanetary medium. Between the stars, interstellar medium. And then every collection of stars that we find is part of a galaxy. galaxy. Then there's this void between the galaxies. Mm -hmm. Could we have stars there? Yes. But our best understanding of all this tells us that these are stars that may have been flung out of a galaxy, typically in a galaxy collision. They're really train wrecks when they happen, right. and when they do, stars fly hither and yon. So they just escape the train they, wreck, they and then they're on their own they way. They escape the train and they're on their own. So they're rogue stars, basically. That's the word. They're rogue stars. Just the same way you can have planets wandering between the stars, right. and we call them rogue planets. Okay. You can have rogue stars cast asunder after a, a galactic collision. And we have galactic collisions all the time. Uh -huh. And so uh, there's no reason why you couldn't. Yes. And I these see. are stars that are basically homeless in a way. Oh. I know. Do they have signs that say, we'll shine for food? <laughs> they're, they're homeless. Homeless stars. Homeless, uh, galactic homeless stars. Yeah. So there's no reason to, but it's, it would be very hard to see them because uh, stars are not dim. Stars are too dim to give us enough light across intergalactic space for us to tell that they're there. Okay, so they're not staying still long enough for us to see? Is no, you can stay still, but you're one damn star in the middle of a void. And Think about it. When you look out between, when you look out out of our galaxy, right. you need awesome telescopes to see only the brightest stars in other galaxies. Otherwise, it's the merged puddle of light. From the hundred you. billion stars themselves. I got you. You're not picking them You're out. Not picking one them out one at a time. No, you are not. Ah. Well, that's not